So I spent about 13 years in the army. Hilariously enough, I was in the band first. I was a trumpet player, you know, out here playing Reveille and all that fun stuff. And, you know, about 2011, 2010, 2011, uh, I had still been kind of doing Taekwondo a little bit. I was still competing here and there, did some cool stuff, went to like the military Olympics, but I get back and I'm like, well, dang, like I like music, but, you know, I kind of had already picked up that everything was shifting. You know, we had tech was blowing up. Um, you know, it wasn't just being the IT guy. There's now IT teams. There's now security teams and things like that. So I knew I wanted to pivot into IT. And so I had the Army retrain me to be an IT specialist, which was pretty cool. They paid for my security plus, which was even cooler because that was kind of like what gave me that first kind of look into security. I get out, you know, I've worked a couple jobs at this point, startups, phone support, you know, things like that. And I meet my now husband and he took me to my first DEF CON as like our away trip. <laughs> like our first away trip was a hacker con. And, you know, I didn't know what the hell was going on. Like I was still, you know, wow, this is really scary, but really fascinating. And so I get back and I go full bore because I hadn't finished my degree yet. I switched over to, to cybersecurity officially, went to community college, shout out to community college for career changers because it's the cheapest and some of the most comprehensive ways to do that. And then I did my bachelor's and all that stuff. But um, I got my first job at a healthcare SOC. So I worked in the SOC. And then the craziest thing ever, Palo Alto Networks was doing a veterans like training and I went and I got recruited out of the class, which that, you know, that's not a normal everyday thing. And I was there for about five years. But I mean, from that point, I pretty much dove headfirst into the hacker community. I mean, I was going to DEF CON every year. I wanted to be at B-Sides. I started volunteering. And eventually, I, you know, I show up to conferences and everyone's like, oh, hey, Ashley. I'm like, oh, hi. You know, and I, I've poured a lot into it because it's what gave me direction. You know, I, I worked at like UPS slinging boxes and like GameStop and Old Navy and just all these kind of weird jobs that didn't really fit me. And then I find, you know, tech and I'm like, oh, this is where I'm supposed to be this whole time. And so if you know my hacker handle to anyone who's watching, you were probably at the ShmooCon where I publicly sassed uh, the host of Hacker Jeopardy at DEF CON. And that's how I got my hacker handle. So, yeah, I mean... At this point, you know, I went from kind of having some basic security knowledge to really specializing in a lot of different places. You know, if I'm not at a con, I'm like sad about it. You know, I want to go to everything. So that's how I got in the community. And now everyone's like, you know, you can't get rid of me. 